Hi, new art mail just arrived. Let's unbox it. I purchased some handmade watercolor by Dreamy Poppies and their local Indonesian small business. Well, they sent me 10 of their colors before and I absolutely love them. Uh, so yeah, I decided to get more. And their packaging is always extra. I mean, look at this. Really, I have to like unpack it really slowly just to admire it and and let's see oh my god i ordered two and there's three in this and two dot card three dot card oh my okay it's it's just wonderful okay let's put this aside mm, put it like over here so we can see another package sorry i got too excited um so stickers thank you card and um this is a personalized thank you card so yeah i did ask about clee but it wasn't ready yet and they gave me the dot card by the way these are the 10 color they sent me before and i'm obsessed with them now back to the package another thing i love about them is their eco-friendly package and this is like the biodegradable plastic okay this is poppy color kind of red ish red orange is i think and the second is fade um, which is dark ish green ish blue maybe and if you know me you know i love blue and last ballerina this is the bonus i didn't order it but they included it anyway oh my god swatch time first is the ballerina and and yeah the color is so pretty and the second is poppy and yeah i want the red color and oh my god and now the faith just to add another blue collection of mine yeah i have a lot let's try the dot card this one called mora and i think it's dark gold and clean i really want this color oh my god it's so pretty i want it and last daydream let's see oh ooh. okay now it's time to label it put a name on it yeah and yeah okay it's black pepper swatch time this is where the magic happens let's start again with ballerina and look at that now let's see how pop is doing on a black pepper it's appeared darker and still very beautiful i like it okay now we are going with faith let's see i think the blue is a little bit lighter here now let's see how mora's doing okay it looks glam i like it I put the clay here so I can compare it with Poppy, so let's see. I think clay is a little bit darker. And the last but not least, Daydream. It's just beautiful, I don't know. So yeah, I put down their name so I won't forget. And you can see the result here. This one on regular watercolor paper and this one with the black watercolor paper. And I can't help myself, I have to try it out. Here I'm using black watercolor pad from Claire Fontaine and it's 300 GSM and made of cellulose. Okay, let's painting. I spray it down with water and spread the water evenly. Starting out with faith. Um yeah, it's lighter in black paper. And I add this lancelot color which is a little bit darker and one of my favorite Kokomi. Look at that purple. And I'm thinking adding Glee first before Poppy here and yeah, I think it's a good choice. I like the color. Yeah, I really like it. Now it's Poppy time and yeah, it adds more vibrancy here. And like the medium highlight with Daydream because I'm gonna put some of this ballerina as a highlight again. But I want to try all the colors so yeah, don't mind it. I usually do this in the end, but I don't know why I'm doing it now. And now it's the Mora time. I don't know why I'm so excited with this gold color. It's just different from another gold, you know. And now it's the splatter time. And honestly, I don't know how people do it like this because it hurts my hand. So yeah, I'm, I, I'll just do it like this. Uh, it's better. So whenever I almost finish a painting, this always happen i think it's just a me problem yeah don't mind it also i don't understand why my camera is like this whenever i try to film my painting with black paper yeah maybe it's just a that problem i don't understand anyway it's yeah i think it's finished now and finally it's ready to take the tape off 
the most satisfying part. So in my opinion, Dreamy Poppies is really good watercolor. I really love them. If you're from Indonesia, you have to check them out. And if you're not from Indonesia, I encourage you to check out your local handmade watercolor small business and go support them. So yeah, that's it. Um, I'll put the information on the description box below. And thanks for watching. See you.